Hey everybody, it's Mike with CRM Pros. I wanted to talk to you a little bit tonight about a model context protocol or MCP server. Everyone's talking about these and I wanted to bring you up to date on a little bit about what they are, what they can do and how they can help your go high level agency. So basically an MCP server is like a smart helper basically. It keeps all the parts of a computer system talking to each other the right way. It helps different programs or machines understand what's going on by sharing information in a format they all understand. It's kind of like this. It's kind of like a coach during a football game. It doesn't play, but it tells each player what's happening and what they should do next. This makes sure everything works together smoothly like a team. Basically, MCP servers are used all over the place these days. Games, smart machines, virtual assistants, and even go high level. I'm going to show you tonight on how you can control your go high level MCP server and control your whole go high level sub account using go high level integrated voice. AI. I'm going to go ahead and show you a little bit how we can do a demo here with the MCP server controlled with voice AI that's native to go high level. As you can see, I have a dummy contact in this test account. His name is John Doe and I have an AI tag off here to the right. I'm going to go ahead and toggle over to my Google voice and I'm going to dial up the MCP server. This is basically calling go high level right now and we're going to interact with the agent. Hello, I'm your CRM Pro's Go High Level Assistant. I can help with your CRM tasks like scheduling, contacts, and tags. How can I assist with your CRM today? Remove tag AI off from contact John Doe. The tag AI off has been successfully removed from John Doe's contact record. Need help with anything else? No, that's it. Thank you. I appreciate it. You're welcome. You're welcome. I'm glad I could help. I could Have help. a wonderful day. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye. You... So it still shows that it's here, but once we refresh, you're going to see that the tag has been removed. We're going to go ahead and do another demo for you, and then we're going to jump in under the hood and see how this thing really works and how you guys can do this yourself. I'm going to share all the resources with you and give you a step-by-step -step on how to exactly set this up on your own and we'll go for it. So here we go. We're going to dial this again. This is going to be a little bit different. So we're going to be on the road and let's just say I have to send an email. So I want to send a contact an email over the voice and I want to use my Gmail though. So I'm going to go ahead and call the MCP and do this. Hello, I'm your CRM pro's go high level assistant. I can help with your CRM tasks like scheduling, contacts, and tags. How can I assist with your CRM today? Send email to contact John Doe subject urgent message i look forward to seeing you in my office at nine o'clock a.m tomorrow for an important meeting about go high level the email to john doe with the subject urgent message has been successfully sent if you have any further requests or need additional assistance just let me know thank you i appreciate it you're welcome i'm glad i could help if there's anything else you need just give me a shout have a great day you too now let's go ahead and see if the email has been sent. There it is right here. New email at 652 and that's just now. Let's see what it says. I look forward to seeing you in my office at 9 o'clock tomorrow for an important meeting about Go High Level. It was marked urgent. That is a wrap. I'm going to show you under the hood now. We're using N8N as a medium to go ahead and control the MCP and hook it up to Go High Level. So basically we have a webhook coming in right here, a standard webhook, which I'll show you. And essentially that's hooked up to Go High Level. And anytime the voice agent from Go High Level communicates, it translates it, brings it into this webhook. Then it goes into this AI agent, and we have a pretty extensive prompt in here, which you're going to see up in here, which I will share. It'll be a nice little package, so you guys can go ahead and replicate this on your own. And I hope you guys have fun with it. The sky is really the limit. So let me go back here, and then we also have the OpenAI chat model that's going to be working behind the scenes to go ahead and control some of these tools. We have the memory, then we have the MCC, MCP client, that's what's going to go to the tools, which we'll show you here in a second. And then once the tools communicate, they'll come back here, and this will respond back to the webhook, so it basically respond back to Go High Level and update the agent there, and then that'll tell me on the telephone that the task has been completed or what has happened after, we're, after we executed these tools. What I'd like to do now is I'm going to show you a little demo on how we can get a contact's information and what you actually are provided when you do get the contact's information. So I'm going to go ahead and make a call. I'm going to request John Doe's contact information. Here we go. 
Hello, Hello, I'm your CRM, CRM Pros Go High Level Assistant. Assistant. I, can I can help with your CRM, CRM tasks, tasks like scheduling, like scheduling contacts, contacts, and tags. And tags. How can I assist can with I assist your CRM, CRM today? today? A search contact, John Doe. John Doe's contact info in Go High Level. Here's what I got. Name, John Doe. Phone, 561-777-242. Email, michaelthomasreimer at gmail.com. Address, 123 Main Street, West Palm Beach, Florida, 33412. Company name, Mike's Tree Trimming. Need to do anything else with this contact? No, that's it. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. You're welcome. You're welcome. I'm glad I could help. help. Have a fantastic, have a fantastic day. day. Goodbye. 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 And that's that. And I, on purpose, didn't put my whole phone number because I didn't really feel like getting calls all night. So thank you guys for listening. We're going to do one more quick demo, and that's going to be it for today. What you wanted to see is this whole entire workflow, basically, or this layout of the MCP. These are where all the tools reside. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to zoom in on some of these and move around so you can see exactly what we have hooked up here. Obviously, you can hook up as much or as little as you want. These are all endpoints as far as Go High Level is concerned. So we have search contacts. So I can go ahead and look up contacts. I can create contacts. I can update contacts. I can get contacts. There's just a lot of things you can do. You can actually get the contact and get their information. Once you click on one of these, these are all set up, and I will share screenshots of all of this for you, so there's no need to screenshot it now. And then the next ones we have are going to be the task tools. I can get a task, I can create a task, I can update a task. Then we have our appointment tools. I can book an appointment with a contact. I can get appointments for a specific contact, and I can delete appointments, all done through my Go High Level voice agent. I can send SMSs, so I can say, look up contact John Doe, send SMS, I won't be making the meeting tomorrow, and it will send, and they'll get an SMS immediately. Same thing, I can update conversations, I can add and remove tags, which is huge in Go High Level, as you guys are well aware. I can, that means I can add them to certain workflows, I can tag them so they're not getting calls, I can tag them so they're getting calls, all the things that are associated with tags, you guys are well aware of that opportunities i can go ahead and create them get them delete opportunities and then basically move them along the pipeline and so on i can add and remove to workflows so i could say hey listen i want this contact to be in this specific workflow and then i've got some non go high level tools here one is a google map scraper so i have this i could be on the phone i can say listen go high level i need you to scrape all the electricians in zip code 33411 it will put them in a sheet and then i'll direct it go ahead and send out my emails or add them to a workflow to send emails out to go ahead and contact and create leads on the fly uh, this was the Gmail function that I showed you earlier and how you guys saw how that worked and we got email sent. And then lastly, I have outbound AI calling, which I will show you here in a few moments. That's behind the scenes under the hood here as we're using retail AI. And basically we can go ahead and do outbound calling by speaking to the go high level agent and say, listen, initiate a sales call and it will make the call for us. Now what we, uh, what we didn't go over was this is the server. So basically remember in the other workflow, we had the client and the client communicates to the server and then the server sends out the request to individual tools, which you can see them illuminating. And then once that's done, it goes back to the client and then it hits the webhook and goes back to our go high level. So that's how that works underneath the hood. I will share all of this with you. I will even share the workflow. So I'm in N8N and basically I can export this workflow, which I will be sharing. And you guys can go ahead and import it directly in. So none of this, there's not going to be a lot of heavy lifting here. You guys will be able to import this right in. And that's it. That's the, the crux of it here. The next demo we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and get a contact's information and see what actual data we get when we call up a contact with the MCP server. So I'm dialing the number now, and then I'm going to go ahead and call up John Doe's contact information. Hello, I'm your CRM Pro's Go High Level Assistant. I can help with your CRM tasks like scheduling contacts and tags. How can I assist with your CRM today? Search contact John Doe. 
I found John Doe's contact, contact info in the, info in the system. system. Here's what I got. Name, John Doe. Phone, 561-777-242. Email, Michael Thomas Reimer at gmail.com. Address, 123 Main Street, West Palm Beach, Florida, 33412. Company name, Mike's Tree Trimming. He's got a couple couple of opportunities opportunities open, too. too. Need anything else with this contact? contact? No, that'll do it. I appreciate it very much. You're welcome. welcome. I'm glad I could help. help. If you need anything anything else, just give me a shout. shout. Have a great day. So you notice it brought up the contact information. You can get as much or as little data as you like. That's all programmable with the webhook. And then the other thing is you notice that my phone number was cut off, which I did that on purpose because I didn't want to be added to a bunch of call lists this evening. So I did that. And same thing with any of the other caller information that'll be removed later. But like I said, I'm going to get you guys all of this stuff in a little nice package and you guys can go ahead and make your own MCP server and hook it up to go high level. We've got two more things that we're going to go over. I want to show you the voice agent itself on how it's programmed. And then lastly, we're going to do an outbound call. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to look under the hood here inside go high level. This is my test account and I have a voice agent in here. This is named N8N agent, obviously using Jessica as the voice. Inbound call. This is the prompt that you guys just heard over and over when we're doing our demos. That's pretty basic. I'm sure everybody's used to that. Then we're going to go ahead into the agent goals section. This is where it all happens. So basically I have a prompt here, which I again will share with you guys. This is the greeting, what happens during the call, how the the formatting of the call and the workflow of the call, the actual flow. Then the most important part is this summarized task and send to N8N custom action. This obviously was just hand, just added to Go High Level recently. And then here's the uh, here's behind the scenes on that, which I will, again, be sharing with you guys. So there's no need to screenshot it. But basically, this is the entire way that this communicates with N8N and is controlling it via the voice system. If you have any questions, I'm available always through DM. However, I cannot provide unlimited tech, technical support on this if you're running into a little bit of stumbling blocks. You're going to have to watch the the video. We're going to come back and we're going to do one more demo. And the next demo we're going to do, and this is the last one for the day, is we're going to go ahead and do the outbound call. So this is prompted dynamically. So you could tell it to sell them on database reactivation. And then the next call, you can say, call another contact and go ahead and prompt it and do it on the fly and say, hey, I want to sell them voice AI. However, you'd set this up and the sky is really the limit. So I'm going to go ahead and dial the MCP. I'm going to be using my cell phone because I need to answer the call. And I'm going to lower the, lower the Google voice as soon as I dial it because I don't want to get feedback. Hello, Hello I'm your I'm CRM, CRM pro, pro, Go High Level, level assistant. assistant. I can help I with can your help CRM, CRM tasks, tasks like scheduling, scheduling contacts, contacts, and tags. And tags. How, can How can I assist with your CRM, CRM today? today? Outbound call to contact John Doe. Just to confirm, Just you'd like me to set up an outbound, outbound call to John Doe in your CRM. CRM. Is that correct? That correct. Yes, that's correct. I've initiated an outbound call to John Doe. Hi, Mike. This is Amy from CRM Pros. Do you have a minute? Yeah. Small businesses like local biz domination get three to five warm leads per day using AI and outbound automation. Can I ask you two quick questions to see if it's a fit? Yeah, sure. Perfect. Let's jump in. How are you getting most of your new clients right now? Referrals, ads, cold outreach? Mostly ads, Facebook, usually. Got it. Facebook ads make sense. And who is your perfect client? Who are you really trying to target? Generally, I deal with, I'm a tree trimmer. So basically I trim trees. So I'm just looking for like condominiums and homeowners with a lot of trees that need to be cut down. Thanks for sharing that, Mike. So you're targeting homeowners and condominiums with significant tree trimming needs make sense. We're doing something different. Our system blends LinkedIn, email, and AI follow-up to bring in consistent, qualified leads without the usual headaches. Would it make sense to set up a quick call with our strategy team to show you how it works for companies like yours? I'm just in the middle of a demo right now, so I'm going to have to call you back if that's okay. Totally understand, Mike. I'll send over a quick overview and we can circle back next week. Appreciate your time and have a great day. Thank you. There you have it. That concludes our little demo on the MCP. If you guys need anything else, you know where to find me. And thank you for listening. I appreciate it very much.